All right, guys, today is a full moon, and I'm starting very early, 8 in the morning. I had to go get me some Hardy's breakfast. Other than that, I'm starting as early as I can, and I'm going all day. I think I'm going to do spot hopping. Right now, I'm at a waterfall, and it's so low and clear. It's per Oh, my God, I have not seen it this clear in years. It's usually dingy. I've never seen it like this in a long time. My goodness, it's gin clear. Very unlike this place. Wow. Oh, I see what I was getting hung on a lot now. Guys, that is one hell of a fish right here. One hell of a hybrid. I'm not gonna weigh him, but he's six to seven pounds. That's exactly why I came here. Wow. It doesn't get better than that, guys. Sweet. <laughs> All I can say is, wow, that was a way to start the day. I had to send her a message, sent her some pictures, my dad and some other friend. Had to rub in the, the, the high, big hybrid stripe for the first cast of the day. I'm ready to come down and get some more. Let's just see what happens. I'm lucky I landed him, honestly. This is only 10 pound mono. I really should be using my braid if you want my honest opinion. I'm already hitting fish. They're right there. There he is. Oh, I got another giant. Oh man, what do I got now? This is dark black. I think this might be a buffalo. Hear that or a flathead? Holy cow! Now I got a big flathead. Wow, full moon bite is on, guys. Oh yeah, flathead on a lure. Fucking right. Not a big guy, but I am so happy because I've been wanting one of these. Sweet. Little baby flathead, but it's cool. Mm. 
man, oh man, oh man. What a variety, this is a buffet. Alright guys, nice little flathead. He's only about two pounds, but that's cool, man. I'm happy. I was wanting to go to the Mississippi River tomorrow to get these. I already got one here. Not the size I'm looking for. There we go. Big hybrid again. <laughs> oh yeah, or a big white bass, one of the two. It's a giant white bass, actually. Yeah. Yes it is. Big old white bass. Big poor white bass, and he inhaled that thing. I cannot even see the jig head whatsoever. Oh, come here, buddy. Yes, what a variety. Hybrid striper followed by flathead followed by white bass. That's a pretty decent one at that. It could be a little hybrid. Actually does look like a hybrid now that I'm looking at it. Just a small one. Nice white bass or hybrid. It's hard to tell, he's so kind of dull. Nice fish. Full moon bite is on, guys. Completely on. I did, could not have picked a better day to come here. And it's at right at the perfect level. This thing sucks in the spring. It's too high. It don't get no better than the way it is right now. Another white bass. All right. Yes. Guys, in the during the fall transition, when these fish are gorging on shad, you cannot go wrong with it. just a pl plain color of white, just regular old white. There's nothing wrong with it. It's. I learned that yesterday they were biting just the plain color white more than any other color. All right, nice little white bass, about 10 inch. There we 
go. Boy, this ain't bad, whatever this is. I don't know what I got. Another white bass. Hell yeah. Man. Actually, it's a hybrid, guys. Another hybrid. Yeah, small one, but that is definitely not a white bass. My second hybrid stripe of the day, guys. Little guy, but it is a hybrid. Sure is. Nice little hybrid. About right at 11 or 12 inch. Heck yeah, man, this is a lot of fun. I am glad I chose this place over some of the other things I could have done. For once in my life, I ain't gonna get home today and go, I wish I would have went there instead of here. Because I do that a lot. But today, I'm glad I came where I did. Heck yeah, man. I do not regret coming here. A big old hybrid, a flathead, and three white bass so far. And I've only fished about 30 minutes. Man. There we go. All right. Oh yeah, I got a carp. Asian carp or buffalo, one or two. Not a regular carp. It could be a grass carp, Asian carp, or buffalo. And it looks like I got him foul hooked. So this is going to take a while. Yep, he's in the dorsal fin. Oh man, this is going to be... I'll probably lose it. It's going to rip out. Because it's just a single hook. That may be a grassy. I can't quite tell yet. That looks like a big head. digging. He's a 20 pounder or so. Still can't tell what kind it is quite yet. It is a grass carp. Yes. Oh man. God. Had it all the way that far guys. Had him on for three minutes. Man, he was a 20 pounder easily. Goodness gracious, man. There we go. Oh yeah. What do I got? What do I got? Something not half bad, whatever it is. I don't know if it's fair hook. I think it's a big drum. Is it a drum or a stripe? It's a drum. It sure is. What's well, a big one though? I'll give him that. I'll give him credit. He's four pounds anyway. I might be able to lift him up, but. All right. Yep, yeah, about a four pound drum. Oh boy. Definitely pliers time. I'm gonna get one. Might as well be one this size. It's about five, about four pounds.
Alright, looks like I got a half decent channel cat this time. Now that's not bad. I don't mind catching them when they're that size. He's big enough to eat. It's like the size you buy at the store. Heck yeah. That ain't bad. That's more like it. That is more like it. That is not not a horrible little channel cat there. About a little over a pound. He's better anyway, he's a foot long. Terrible. All right. Hey, I'll take him anyway. Way better than them ones I was getting this morning. Heck yeah. Nice. Oh yeah. Real dark white bass. Obviously a female. Or a male, I mean. <sighs> hey, my thing worked. It took adding that split shot to get it down in that current, guys. Because I do not have my heavier jig heads with me on vacation. The heaviest ones I got is quarter ounce. Nice little white. May even be a small hybrid, I'm not sure. I think it's a white bass. Not bad. like in the tail toward the rear anyway it's gonna probably come off because it's a single hook the odds are against me but I just pray I can get this one I've been trying to get a carp that's the only reason I haven't left and I just haven't had the luck now my luck's gonna run out when he gets me in that current like that I gotta get him over here on the left side and it's just almost impossible, man. He just wants to run me straight into that tree. That might be a silver carp. It looks like it. As opposed to a big head, it looks silver to me.
man, it's hard to get this guy. Oh, well, here's the moment of truth, guys. Got him! I got him! Oh, yeah! Boy, I got lucky that time. That hook could have just popped out at any moment. Oh, my goodness. Just barely in the tail with a single curly tail. My God. We're talking barely in there, guys. Wow. Finally got one of the things I came after. The striper and the... Uh, Flathead were just bonuses. That could have just pulled out at any time. My goodness. Uh, I'm going to get my gloves on. He's about 20 pounds. Not as big as the one I caught last time. I do believe this is a silver carp, though. Yeah, it is. It's not a big head. So that's kind of a different kind. I haven't caught since I was down at Kentucky Lake. So that's pretty cool. gill plate like a big head does. It looks more silvery. Yeah, about, about 15 pounds. I'm not going to give him 20, but it is decent. Nice fish either way, guys. Lucky to catch him on what I did. A single curly tail grub. 